What's up guys, this is Everything Apple 76 and I'm going to be showing you how to create a brightness changer for iOS. Now, this is a feature that I think is pretty darn useful, except not many people know about it. Um, one of the things I am going to tell you is that you can only use it on iOS 5 or above. So if your device is still running iOS 4, you cannot use this. So to make the brightness uh, switcher, the first thing you're going to need to do is drag out a slider and a label like what I did and then make sure that the slider is set to the minimum as 0 and the maximum as 100 the current I would recommend being at 50 just because it's in the middle and then make sure that the label says percentage colon 100 percent once you're done with that go into the assistant editor close out the left hand side and then in these brackets if you don't have them you can create them drag an outlet or create an outlet in the brackets from the slider call it SLDR brightness and then from the label call it LBL brightness When you're done with that, go into your .m file and then go into your muted load and then type UI screen, main screen equals UI screen, main screen and then CG float brightness equals main screen dot brightness times 100 the reason why you do times 100 is because <clears throat> whenever you call main screen times brightness the brightness value comes in a float value which is between 0 and 1 so it'll be a decimal between 0 and 1 and actually what we want to do is have this not be a, a CG float but have it be an int that way it would just round up to the next number uh... and yep yeah. so then do sldr brightness that value equals brightness which sets the slider to the current brightness on the screen and then you want to do lbl brightness that text equals ns string string with format then you want to do percent f comma brightness oh I'm sorry my notes that I have are for keeping that as a float sorry it's supposed to be for percent d not percent f so that sets the current brightness of the screen to the label and to the um, and to the uh, slider. Next thing you're going to want to do is go into your storyboard or your .xib file. Go back into your assistant editor. Control click and add a add an action from your slider. Call it slider to change. go back into your .m and then type UI screen main screen equals UI screen main screen just like we did again or just like what we did above and then this time you're going to want to do main screen that brightness equals slider brightness that value divide by 100 because the brightness value in the slider was set from 0 to 100 then you're going to want to do lbl brightness that text equals and a string string with format percent d 
And then this time what you want to do is you want to set it to SLDR brightness that value. That way the text is set to whatever the value is for the slider. Now if you go ahead and run it, oh sorry, that one is supposed to be dat f, not dat d. Now if you go ahead and run it, you are going to find some errors. Uh, if you run it on the simulator, because the simulator cannot change the brightness of the device. See, 50, and then see how it's not changing the brightness of anything? That's because it can't, because it's only a simulator. Now, if you were to run it on a device, I can assure you that it will work as expected. And that is about it. That is how you create a brightness slider for iOS. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to uh, comment if you have any questions. I will get back to you. Um, and make, make sure to uh, follow me. Uh, and, yeah, that's it. Bye.